Hello everyone, welcome back to Surviving Mars. Let's continue the terraforming of the planet. I would like to say what happened last time, but I just couldn't remember. But I have a feeling we lost Peter. Yeah, he is no longer pinned. Well, rest in peace, Peter. Okay. We spent on capturing ice asteroids mission. That's good. This is... It has been turned off. Ah, because of the cold wave, of course. But it seems my energy problems are solved. However, it's night time, but I think I can uh, turn them back since I have left only 7 hours of cold wave. And this means I probably... Yeah, I have turned back this one. Let's just check all the factories, but the amplifications are on. I haven't turned them off, okay. Uh, I haven't buy this amplification. Minus one, but the cold wave is almost over, so I'm not too concerned about it. However, we have unemployed. Unemployed in this dome? Are you kidding me? That reminds me what I'm researching. Ah, we are researching planetary pro projects. That's good. That will give us the opportunity to to start seeding Mars. And until then I just start moving waste rocks around because why not and I shouldn't empty that one I should empty these ones out of living space. So let's build a few more apartments. And I have to build something to occupy the people. Hmm. What should we build? Oh, new planetary anomalies. I will check them out. A low G amusement park. Have some fun. Champion resources. It is cool that. Uh, oh, and it's just the water and the atmosphere. How can I? Yes, I can rotate the other mouse button. I don't know, but this is just just looks cool. So new technologies. That's a good one. So 
was the, that was the crossroads. Another new technologies. An unknown resources. New technologies. Resources. Resources. So we have a few new technologies missions. And I almost have all of them. Once I get this one, I start to send those missions out because uh, those will grant me research points instead of new technologies and usually quite a nice amount. Which means it, I mean like 3000, 4000 points per mission. Of course, another thing that can soak up Dust storm approaching. That's not good for souls. You know what? Just just for fun and just to be on the safe side let's do this let's put another oxygen tank there I might be able to fill it before the dust storm hits and we will have a meteor storm that's also a problem so but I have lasers for for that problem now so let's put one there And I don't want to have an asteroid impact here, so... Put a laser there, and I think I will put another laser somewhere here. Yeah, for the water production. Things turning green. Ah, because of this one. Okay. And now start moving base rocks around. I just like to clear all the base rocks until the end of the game. It's, it's like a mini game for me. Uh, and I have to turn this back. Oh, it has been turned off. That's not good. I need atmosphere. That would prevent the dust storms in the long run, if I remember correctly. Yes, 50% atmosphere. That's my target number. You know what, I think this dome will be the... Uh, the power production dome. So how about putting another fusion reactor there. Let's link it.
I need to build at least one more of it. Luckily I have no atmospheric loss. Can I build rockets? Yes, I can. Okay, that's good to know. And what do I need for a rocket? Metals, a little bit of electronic parts and machine parts, machine parts. Plenty of room and plenty of jobs. These holes are in the wrong places. It's a shame I cannot fill them or cover them or something so I can build uh, on it. So how much cost another carbonate processor? Oh yeah, we have some concrete problems or we will have so I have to be careful about what I am building because this building costs 200 concrete and leaving only a hundred for a colony this big I I feel that's a bit risky. And I have no reason to take that risk right now. So dust storm and the meteor storm at the same time. That never have happened before. I mean that, that they are exactly hitting the colony in, in the same time. And Oh, that, that's just a warning period. Uh, I thought they were the exact same length. But they could be. We'll see. Unemployed. Are you kidding me? Let's open the bar. And the diner and you will have workplaces oops, more quick a little bit of repairs and, and even the dome is a little repair. So how's my <coughs> oxygen reserves? <coughs> Five soul. That should be enough. Okay, it's starting. 
it's hitting the colony. At least the dust storm is just one soul. It doesn't matter, the laser will. Nice shot! I'm so glad I build the lasers. So let's find a place to another carbonate processor. Hmm, that looks good. But I'm stopping this. I just wanted to find the place. This will be the next technology after that I want to research. And what's that? Safe mode. That's also cool. The community suffers that they fall asleep and wake up after a bit silence and the community can't commit suicide or game falls due to sanity breakdown. I I need that right now. How's my reserves holding out? I think we are good. As far as reserves goes. I put some cable here. Meteor incoming. Do I have no I didn't have protection there. So, where do I need to put that laser? There. At least the sandstorm is over. But shouldn't the meteor storm move away from my position? Or something like that? I can import greenhouse gases. And I want to import greenhouse gases. In that one, I try to get another rocket. At least I have the laser now. That would have been a nasty place for the meteor to hit. One more soul. Research complete. 
We have safe mode. Meteor incoming. Why? What's what's there that is important? I hope I can solve the atmosphere before the next meteor storm hits us. Not so, but thick enough to get protection. Oh, from the asteroids, I think for that I need 80%. Yeah. Okay, so meteors will be a constant threat, so I have to build lasers accordingly, which means I want to have a laser here. not nice to hit the pipes but it's still nicer if it hits like there but I think uh, we can deal now meteor storms as well so I think at this point it's only a matter of time before I can finish this playthrough but I, I want to finish it, not leaving halfway. I think this is one of the downside of this game, that the end game is just long for the sake of being long. I will salvage the the do uh, dome drone also I need or it would be nice I rather say that it would be nice to have a drone factory or drone assembler Yeah, I can put it there. So let's put a drone assembler here, so I can make drones. Well, I'm close to 400. So I think this project is a go. send this back for funding as well one rocket is on mission so I bring another rocket here
the ground is nice it's starting to look nice It would be also nice to be able to create rovers. That's also useful. And I build another Hawking Institute here because why not what's my oh I have to start building biorobotic uh, biorobotics workshops okay I need a technology for that I put it on the list because I think yeah I'm full well right now there's nothing else to do just moving waste rocks from one pile to the other and we can watch as they are processed How interesting. Or should I say how fascinating. We have a ship that arrived. Or rocket. But it's effectively it's a spaceship. New special projects. have imported greenhouse gases so I can do that again Seven source. of course because the scientists are sleeping now they started to work just three souls You know what? I use this rocket to import some greenhouse gases again. And then I keep this here because I suspect when I research the planetary projects I will be able to send out uh, a rocket to seed Mars and improve the vegetation rating. I don't bother to build more of these because uh, it will be maxed out at 30%. For this uh, playthrough I turned off uh, the... There's a mod which allows the vegetation grow over 30% uh, with these plantation buildings. What you call it? Forestation plant. Okay. Slowly but surely it is building up. Now we have some atmosphere loss. But I can compensate that with magnetic shielding. Maybe we have defenses for that. That's what I'm talking about. A good old laser against meteors.
so you should import greenhouse gases I want that 40% to happen Forty, fifty, fifty. No, this still okay. It's still going for that special mission. I have to clear these three and then I will have the space uh, for the excavator which will produce me unlimited uh, not unlimited power but unlimited concrete Okay, I need here another diner at least and an inf uh, infirmary and I will have to build a polymer factory here. And of course another building, what I mean uh, an apartment building. And uh, I should place the polymer factory here. Polymer, polymer factory. some power and some water this is working because through these passages the dome gets water and it can distribute all the way to the polymer factory I have resources for everything and I want at least two shifts and I haven't upgraded amplification here of course I can do that now because I have fusion reactors I wish we would have that in real life. But I heard they are closing on it. But I also heard it's like a meme that we are always five years away from fusion energy. Twelve hours, but suddenly all the researchers will go home to sleep, and it will jump back to one soul. Let's see, let's see. See, not one soul, but it at least doubled the time. But they will have a good morning because they go into the workplace and they discover something.
Almost, almost. I have only one prefab left. That's not good. Let's make some drone prefabs. Research complete. And we have the cloud seeding special project, and I sending this one. Not the cloud seeding seed, seed vegetation. I had to do 20 missions of seeding vegetation, and this means all my tech trees are discovered. And I kind of want this as well. I don't really need these two. Let's go that way. And let's start analyze these anomalies first. loading the rocket with seeds I think I can just squeeze in Dust 45 in no I want to start this mission before the uh, that storm, that's dust storm. But this one is working now. I wanted to call another rocket, but I realized the dust storm will prevent to land. Still, why not? At least after the end of the dust storm, uh, it can just touch down. found she should have said analyzed unless anomaly analyzed unless unless we have one more here Polymer factory is working. I don't know why this scientist works in a polymer factory instead of working on the Hawking Institute, but you know what? I let it slide. I don't really care mean moxing the colonists at this point. Mm. 
new special project I have a lot of special projects going on so I might need a new site for rockets hmm. okay how about putting a universal dep uh, depot here adding some pipes adding a uh, fuel refinery making a landing pad adding a couple of drones here I want to increase the no. minimum dust storm in 12 hours 12.20 Okay, quickly, let's send an expedition there. I don't know why do we have two dragon ones. And of course I'm hoping to a uh, short dust storm. And I will call another rocket. The seeding is ongoing. Okay, last few. Okay. And now the dust on preventing, it will prevent these rockets return. But hopefully it will be just uh, one day and those guys won't die on board. Homeless, but in... How can I zero on him? That worked before. Anomaly analyzed. Un homeless, unemployed, but which dome? None. Oh, of course! See? 300, 305,000. It's almost complete. So, when you have all the research, you can... Uh, all your techs... Res uh, not research, but available to you then the new technologies anomalies grant you uh, research bonuses nine passenger oh they will survive
We have a leak. It's not a big problem. We have plenty of power. And the reserves will hold. Atmospheric loss is 0.2. I hope I can pump it up to 50% before the loss will equal the process or the increase, I should say, before it equal the increase. crane and now the rockets can land resources are low three swords that's not low 12 hour would be low come on quickly refuel the rockets Research complete. So I can send them on further missions. Well, I can. Oh, this is a dragon one. This is a dragon one, and it's a dragon two. Three, two, one. I call up the gasp and uh, gasp, and then cheers. The project was successful. A rocket filled with billions of seeds emptied its storage unit in a well orchestrated chain of steps, spreading the seeds over a vast range of land. Most of these seeds will take root, and the resulting swath of Greenland will begin pumping out oxygen into the fledgling Martian atmosphere. That's nice. So. I need to capture ice asteroid ice asteroids. That's one thing. And And that's it. I was under the impression that I have other missions available. But that's not the case. As you said. Almost my entire colony is Mar uh, Martian born. Which is good because they get all the benefits from research in technologies. Hmm. 
I need to expand. One homeless, that's not my concern. Can I do biorobotics work? No, I can't. I need to research technology for that, and uh, I think I should. I haven't built anything here, but I wanted to build a art store. And something green. That's that's too big of a garden for there. How about a small fountain? Meteor incoming. Still not ready. You know what? You will be little dragon. What's your name? Phoenix. And there's also an amplifying upgrade to these. But core heat connector. Yeah, this one. I have the option to build a magnet magnetic fuel generator. Well done. This is a nice place for a magnetic field generator. So I need a universal depot. I don't need fuel, I don't need seeds, I don't need real metals, I don't need food. I need the other resources and I will need at least 15. I need... Uh, what do we need? Hmm. Let's put sterling generators here. However, it might well be build a wind turbine just to check uh, how much energy it can produce. Maybe if it can produce around 10 that would be enough for your purposes. So uh, I want to build that building because that will decrease the atmospheric loss. Maxed out on those. What's this drilling noise? I never heard that before. Well, I heard it a few 
minutes ago, but I mean in other playthroughs, I never heard that. And I wonder what's that. Now it's working and oh, it's 11 and it's not even upgraded with polymer blades. Let's upgrade it. 14. Okay, that's good enough for me. With a 34% terraforming boost. That's just... Ooh, seed vegetation. Uh, I need that project to start immediately. And... Little Dragon should do it. And I should help loading the seeds. Usually my my goal is to terraform Mars before 365 souls to mimic uh, a year uh, a year on Earth. It's a shame I can't uh, load it with fuel, which reminds me I haven't upgraded uh, anything on this one, but I should. Okay, so a magnetic fuel generator. I try to put it and it needs 100 power. Hmm. Maybe I should. Put down a few sterling generators as well. Especially because I want to build multiple of these. No, it is not. I told you it is not. Let's load some metals and and bring some here because this will need a lot of metals that's why I don't like this storage it takes a lot of time Okay, now you are good. And even and even if uh, and even if you fail to deli deliver in time, but I think it will. in time oh so much food so much food I don't think that food will be a problem this open farm is, is such a cheat 
Okay, it's it's not cheap on water, but still, if you can afford one, it can feed almost it can feed your entire colony, even with the one uh, thousand goal in mind. Yes, I remember. We should. Uh, Start thinking on expanding our colony. A basic dome and a mega dome. A mega dome will go there, but I stop. I stop progress. Capture ice asteroids. And there's another project again to capture ice asteroids. It's already in progress. So the Phoenix. I'm sending the Phoenix to capture ice asteroids. <laughs> okay. That's nice. It can melt it on the way to the surface. Okay, how much? It will need quite a bit still. Uh, rocket has arrived. What? What's blocking? A holy dome! With the further expansion of the colony, there is a petition among our growing religious community to proclaim Mars a holy land. This is a sensitive subject that could stir some controversy in the colony. Ah! I would choose this, but since the leader is a politician, uh, I can say we are all, all members of the human race equally. So no consequences. Let's move some more waste trucks. I can import greenhouse gases now. Let's use you to import those greenhouse gases. Great. And I tell you why I'm an idiot, because I build these things here and I should have built them here because I already lost one square is it a square? I don't think it is one space that's the word I uh, was looking for one space uh, here but I can fit three buildings there however I will build a few of those especially with the diner Because, because people are like to eat, obviously. Not a drilling sound. 
Where does it come from? Just in the right moment. Ah, and of course the reason why I build it here because these buildings will produce more, uh, more squeaks. And I don't want to damage any of my colony buildings. And this is three thirty three point. 33 okay so it's point it can decrease it with point 0.2 and we have another seed project this is seed vegetation okay You will also see vegetation, my friend. Dragon 1. And you will be known as the big dragon. And I think the big dragon and the little dragon will do the seeding process. But I should load it. It's nice to give a name but it's even better to give it a payload. Just like in work, it's nice to get a praise, but it's even nicer to get a raise. I didn't want to say that, I wanted to say a paycheck, but then I... I just thought it would be more fun to rhyme. And you know what's more fun? <laughs> Moving waste rocks! <laughs> because that's fun as well. It's slowly decreasing and if I move enough waste rocks away... That's the wrong one. Then I can build the excavator. I can't build the excavator because I don't have enough, uh, what you call it, machine parts. Which means I need to build, I need to build, 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 how about building, a building which can produce machine parts. And it is a prefab as well. So it's free. Seed vegetation is completed. That's good. That's good. And I think we are good for this episode. I hope to reach reach 50 per You know what? We have an ice stories page. I, I will wait for that. So uh, we at least have the 50% water, which means nothing really but we can say we are halfway there so I, I wait for that and why I'm waiting for that let's build a sanatorium here build a university a school and the usual open air gym. Where is the open air gym? And some green stuff. Ah, 
how about a pond? I always pondering about that. I've got fewer problems. I produce enough, but the way, uh, but but the rate I do missions. And the usual thing that I forgot is the ramp. But it's almost full again. Come on, this colonist is ra like rabbits. Okay, let's build another apartment. Let's build another reactor. it will be fine for a time I also wanted to check oh I have to remove three more Concrete situation is not bad, but not good at, but not good as well. And we have captured the isosteroids. Another seed vegetation project. Okay, I have to start that. Hmm, maybe they decrease the waiting time between seed vegetation projects, which is very welcome. Also, I have six and the six. The phoenix has arrived. That means I have already one. That's nice, it will be 20%. I think uh, we are one or two episodes away to finish this playthrough. Maybe three at maximum. But next I will continue with battle tech. During the week or during this week. And maybe one more surviving Mars at the weekend.
Come on. Are you serious? Zero point one. And they finish the fuel first. Of course. Okay, someone has brought that last bit there, but that was just just silly. Okay, guys. If you watched the video uh, this long, I thank you and I will see you in the next one. Bye!